Merry New Year! Happy New Year. In this country, we say Happy New Year. <laughs> Thank you for correcting my English with stink. I am Nanja Ibuko, exchange student from Cameroon. Ha 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 Beef jerky time. You want some beef jerky? Oh, please. There's plenty, you know. This place about to blow. Merry New Year, everybody, and a shout out from the Mofo in 2017. It's the first Mofo show in 2017. That means just one thing. One thing. It's New Year's resolution time. Wow. New Year's resolutions with the mofo. And the mofo, he's got a list. He's got a list of New Year's resolutions that he's given out. Yes, they are resolutions for the mofo, because the mofo doesn't need to resolve to do anything. These are resolutions for everybody else. I'm going to start that list right now. And we're starting with the largest group. And that's the River Dirt at RWA. Easy resolution for y'all. Easy resolution for y'all. It's a shower. Yes, <laughs> that's right. It's a shower. And it's not even that many of a shower. It's not even that often. It's one shower per week. That's your resolution. One shower per week. That's 52 times more often than you do right now. But it's still not that many. It's way fewer than most people do. One per... Hmm. Now that I think about it, that might be too many for you. Okay, so new New Year's resolution for y'all. It's not a shower. It's not a shower once a week. Febreze. That's all the mofo is asking. Just spray some Febreze on yourselves, okay? Just a little Febreze. Febreze. Might I suggest extra strength Febreze? That's your New Year's resolution. Next New Year's resolution. Pow, pow. Dr. Feelbad. New Year's resolution for Dr. Feelbad. New haircut. Yes. No. No. Not that one. Try a different, different one. Not that one either. Nope. No. Definitely not. Not that one either. Can we do something that's maybe a little more obscuring? Maybe? Yes! <laughs> that's it. That's the one. That perfect New Year's resolution haircut for Dr. Feelbad. Boom! Next! Next New Year's resolution. This one goes out to someone we haven't seen in a while. It's our good friend, Watermelon Head, Ryan Edmund. <sighs> Hey, Watermelon Head. New Year's resolution for Watermelon Head? Stay in the hospital. Boom! Perfect! You know, Chris Taylor, he came back. We saw what happened to him. And I'm going to send him back so you guys can reunite in the hospital again. So just stay there, Watermelon Head. Stay there. And there's really good reason for you just to stay there, other than Chris Taylor coming back and you guys holding hands and singing Kumbaya. I hear when spring springs, people are going to be looking to make fruit salad. And that giant Watermelon Head of yours... Be to There's nothing better than a fruit salad on a fine spring day, but watermelon. Pish posh. This place about to blow. All right, final New Year's resolution. The final one, and this one is the most important. The most important. This one is for. Cripple Taylor, Mr. Fragile himself. Yeah, Fragile, it's time for Chris Taylor, you know that, right? Anyway, Chris Taylor, your New Year's resolution. Spend more time with your family. Yeah. Hey, brother, I understand. Life gets busy, you got a lot of stuff to do. It gets to be hard to spend time with your family. And, you know, maybe your family doesn't want to spend time with you because nobody really wants to spend time with you. I don't want to spend time with you. Nobody really wants to spend time with you. They probably don't either, but you want to spend time with them. And because the mofo is such a good guy, because he's such a good guy, 
Really, I'm like a saint. Anyway, because this mofo is such a good guy, such a good guy, he's going to enable your New Year's resolution. He's going to make it easy for you to spend more time with your family because after January 21st, you're going to have anything else to do, my man. Fans bring the weapons. Mofo bring the weapons. <laughs> Bruh. One year ago, you caused me my only loss in RWA. And for a year, I've been kicking your ass. Sending you packing, sending in the hospital, leaving you out, leaving you laying. And you just couldn't get the message. Well, now the message is clear, Chris. Fans bring the weapons. This only ends in one of two ways. You getting carried out. Or me getting carried out. It's one or the other. And you can't do it, bro. You can't do it. To beat me, it took five people one year ago. You don't got five people. You got you. You got you. You don't have Bo Browning. You don't have Doc. You don't have Ryan Edmonds. You don't have Dr. Feelbad. All these guys who lined up to help you to have your back. And I took them all out. I taught them all lessons. They ain't going to be there for you, my man. They ain't going to be there for you on January 21st. It's you and the Mo. Fans, bring the weapons, my man. Understand this, Chrissy. Understand this, Cripple. Understand this, Fragile. January 21st, my man. You get Mo. You get Mo. Fuck. This place about to blow.